Hi, my name is Chris. I'm with the customer success team at Xano. And today I want to talk to you about our new file management feature. The file section enables you to view all of the files that have been uploaded to your workspace, whether that's images, videos, or other attachments. To get to the file management screen, you'll go on the left side over to library and just click files. And you'll see you're presented with a very simple interface here. Right now we don't have any files in our database. So let's go ahead and upload a file just so you can see how that works. I'm going to go up here to the Upload Files button in the upper right corner. And you can either drag and drop or browse for a file. So I'm going to click Browse Files. Let's go ahead and upload one of these images here. So I'll click Open. And you can see just like that, we have our file name, MIME type, our file size, and the date that it was created. You can click and preview the files that have been uploaded as well. So we have the option to download the file straight from here, or you can copy the URL and use that as needed. I'm going to click this X here to close out of that file preview. Now let's say we want to delete a file from our workspace. All we have to do is check the box right next to the file name and click the delete button. You can see we get a little pop up here that says, are you sure you want to delete one file? Remember that deleting a file from this screen is absolutely permanent. There is no way to go back once you do. So make sure to be careful when utilizing this feature. I'm going to click OK here. And now our file is gone, just like that. You can also bulk upload files to this screen. So let me show you how that works. I'm going to click Upload Files again, Browse Files. And all I have to do is just select multiple files at once and click Open. We get a little progress indicator, and we have both of our images here, just like that. Now, the files that appear on this screen won't just be from files you've uploaded on this screen. These will also be files that you've uploaded in your database, as well as files that you've created metadata for in your function stack. That means that files that appear here don't need to be uploaded in the database section. Creating the metadata of a file will add it to this screen, regardless of whether you've added it to one of your database tables. Using this can be extra useful because let's say you have a file in your database and you delete the record. That file isn't actually gone. Now we've enabled you to head into the file management screen and make sure that that file is permanently deleted when you remove it from your database. That was just a quick overview on our new file management feature. I hope it helps. Make sure to be on the lookout for more use cases for how you can utilize this feature in your projects. Be sure to like and subscribe, as well as make sure to visit our Xano community to ask and answer questions with other Xano users. Otherwise, we will see you in the next one.